This is Eyewitness News at 5, and we are streaming live on CBS in Philly. Good evening, everyone. I'm Yuki Washington. And I'm Jessica Cartalia. First at 5, storm damage. Harsh storms blew through the Delaware Valley today, leaving behind downed trees and damaged homes and cars like this scene in Claymont, Delaware. That's where a large tree lifted from its roots and crashed into a car blocking Nodane Avenue. Meteorologists are working to determine whether tornadoes touch down in any of these communities. Let's show you the scene in North Coventry in Chester County, where trees came down on utility wires on Route 724 near the 422 ramps. The storm was caused thousands of power outages in the tri-state area, but some power has been restored. Right now, more than 6,700 people are in the dark. The largest hit areas are in Chester County and Newcastle County. We have live team coverage of the storm damage and what we can expect next. So let's start with Alicia Reed. She's live in Newark, Delaware, where several homes were severely damaged. Alicia? Absolutely, and this block hasn't had power the entire day, and the homeowner for that house behind me will now have to find somewhere else to stay for a while. High winds and rain sent this tree tumbling. It's scary there for a while. The point of impact on the roof left a gaping hole. We come out here, we assess the situation, make sure everybody's all right first and foremost, and then we take a look at the trees, do a walk around, and then... Uh, we kind of just write up an estimate for an insurance company. The homeowner was inside when the tree came crashing down. Major damage can be seen all over. It's wide open into that bedroom. We cleared out underneath just in case, you know, it started pouring tonight. Ron Rose Jr. says luckily his father wasn't near the point of impact. He's pretty shaken up. But he was downstairs when it hit, so he didn't get hurt. It's been quite busy for CNR tree service today, with downed trees all over Newcastle County. Owner Robert Patton says a number of those calls could have been prevented if the trees were maintained before rain or heavy winds. A lot of times there's unmaintained trees. So I highly suggest people just take care of the trees. You know, they need uh, maintenance. Preventive maintenance will go a long way. CNR Tree Service had upwards of two dozen calls today. Their professionals suggest taking care of those trees and getting them inspected. Reporting live from Delaware, Alicia Reed, CBS3 Eyewitness News. Alicia, thank you.